Hey guys, welcome again. I hope you all are having a great and blessed Advent season with our dear mother. So today, another quality of Mama Mary that we are going to look at is gratitude. That is basically thanking, thankfulness to God. So are you a person who thank God for everything or are you a person who, you know, uh, complains often uh, about things going around? So if you look at the Magnificat, there is this one line in the Magnificat which says, The Mighty One has done great things for me. Holy is His name. And this means that our dear mother was so much thankful to God for everything that is happening in her life. She was a person of gratitude. She thanked God always for working wonders in her life. If you look at the Bible, uh, it also talks about uh, having an attitude of gratitude. If you look uh, in the book of Psalms, it says, Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. Uh, His mercy endures forever. Uh, then there are many more verses in the same book. Also, uh, if you look at uh, St. Paul's letter uh, to Thessalonians, uh, it says, uh, Give thanks in all circumstances. So this all means everything. It includes good, bad, uh, worst even the worst conditions so we have to thank god for everything and it's easy for us to thank god for every blessing or every good thing that is happening in our life but that's not what we are called to do what the word of god says is to give thanks in all circumstances and our dear mother is a beautiful example of a person who practiced gratitude in her life also, if you look at the nativity scene, we see, we know that uh, Mama gave birth to Jesus in a manger. It was basically a stable place where animals lived, animals rested and sheltered. So, but Mama did not have any complaint. She was a person of gratitude and she practiced that in her life. She was thankful to God for giving them, giving her that place to give birth to the Son of God. Even before, you know, that reaching that place, even, even while uh, St. Joseph was not able to find place, uh, she believed in her God that God will provide them. God will make a way for them. And what they find at the end of their search, at the end of the journey, was just a stable. Yet, Mama was thankful for that. Today, my dear friends, along with our dear Mama Mary, let us thank God for all that He has done in our life. Let's say, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen.